My latest project is a World War I Eindecker built by Falker. Here you can see it sitting on my driveway and then me carrying it out to the flight line for its first flight. It's a little over 8 feet long with a little over 10 foot wingspan weighs in at just over 11 pounds and has 18 square feet of wing area. I'm flying it with a Scorpion 3026 motor and a 107 prop 4S and it just gives it enough power to fly and it flies very realistically but it certainly doesn't have enough reserve for any fancy maneuvers. Here you can see it coming back across the field this was actually the second flight and uh, during this flight I discovered a, a little thermal indoor uh, updraft uh, right there that raised the airplane about 20 feet for which I was grateful and then as I flew there's there's sort of a like a gully over there that must have been creating some some updraft and here you see me lining up or preparing to land on the uh, end of the second flight. Again, this is no speed demon. It just goes up there and gracefully uh, flies around the skies. And was really a test to see how large a foam-based airplane I could build out of the half-inch insulation foam from Home Depot uh, and still power with this little Scorpion motor. And as you see, it lands quite slowly and comes to a stop, and we had about 5 to 10 knot winds. My other project that I did with the half-inch insulation foam was a Snoopy doghouse. I had seen the originals fly back at the Weak Signals uh, Toledo show back in the late 60s, uh, and uh, had enjoyed watching it fly then that I actually had to build one. Uh, needless to say, these can be a handful uh, as I went through development testing and changing configurations. The roof pitch angle of course makes a big difference in slide sl side slip behavior. But I also found that Snoopy and Woodstock that I put on top of the doghouse actually had a, uh, a stabilizing effect. Uh, maybe even a little larger Snoopy and Woodstock would even make it more stable. But it uh, plows through the sky and will do rolls and I've been able to do a loop with it, although loops are somewhat challenging. But it is uh, indeed fun to fly and a, a crowd favorite. Thank you for watching and thank you for Frank for letting us on the Miramar field today.